Hi, and welcome back to Top Funded. I'm George Jimenez, and I'm here with my co-host, Frank, and we're at the Echelon Thailand 2015 event. Thank you, E27, for inviting us for this cool event. George, have we go inside and take a look? Let's go. Mobile app penetration in Southeast Asia is growing fast, and startups are rushing to gain a foothold in the lucrative app market. Echelon Thailand is a gateway for entrepreneurs, investors, and thought leaders to meet and learn about the latest technological innovations. I'm with Patrick at ProMandate, the uh, professional outsourcing marketplace. Patrick, this sounds like a really neat uh, uh, marketplace that you have. Can you tell us a little bit about it? Uh, we provide outsourcing uh options in uh, legal, tax accounting, IT, web and design uh, through a very simple process that is directed mainly for uh, SMEs, startups and uh, entrepreneurs. So uh, we connect a whole pool of suppliers that is curated uh, and covering those four verticals as I mentioned and looking forward maybe to integrate others if uh, the demand and the supply of course requested. Let's see that you, uh, you simply go on the landing page, you can uh, select your language. So let's go for English. Okay, so you, have, you go for employment agreement. If you need to create a new employment agreement, uh, you, you just submit as few questions as possible. A few of your preferences about uh, your budget, about uh, your travel preferences, when you need the work to be made, if it's within 14 days, where are you located, uh, let's say Bang Na. Your language preferences, would you prefer to be served in English or in Thai? And then uh, if there's any other information, and then uh, it's, that's it, then you register, and once you, you do that, you're directly directed to our pool of, um, of suppliers, and you will receive quotations for professionals that can execute the work that you want. And, uh, and then you're matched, and then you just do your business. So it's a very simple process, it's free for the moment, and uh, it's been encountering a very important success. I think it's uh, really solving a pain point in Bangkok, which is to connect some business with professionals. And uh, that's what we're doing, and, uh, and it's going well so far, so we're looking forward for it to continue like this. Hi, I'm here with uh, Godzilla's, with Matthew. Uh, I suppose he's a Godzilla, depends on the size that I'm standing with him. Uh, can you tell me more about uh, Godzilla's? Yeah, Godzilla's is a new platform based on con content-based and social media-based. The content-based, we have more than 8,000 different tops here that people can uh, consume. We post them on Facebook, we target the people we want, they come by clicking on the top through Facebook to us and then they can begin to consume some tops. And at the end of the day, they also want to create their own tops. Hmm, so I will be able to create my top five list. Yeah, and can share it with your friends. I'll share it with my so friend. The possibility to be informed and entertained on the one hand and to communicate, share and comment the tops of your friends and your own on the other hand. Okay, I'm here with Michael from Max. This is a Taiwanese startup. Can you tell us a little bit about your startup, Michael? Yes, uh, we developed the whole set of uh, advertising bidding system and we're based in Taiwan and then we do pretty well in there and now we want to expand our business in Thai, Thai market. Actually, we just set up a back office last month. The issue of the advertiser is it's hard for them to allocate the precise target audience, but we can help them uh, to base on their profile and to find the right user and deliver the right message the right advertising message to them. And we can also help those e-commerce side to maximize the uh, advertising revenue. So usually they just, just sell the, the, the banner ad to Google. But actually, maybe the price is pretty low. But we can guarantee the, the deal uh, done to us will be definitely higher than, than Google or other global vendor. Tell me about you drink and drive, Pete. All right. So uh, our company is an app for driver on demand. A little bit different from Uber because uh, Uber would have their own car, right? But we send driver to drive your car. So when you, you go out at night and you drink, right? You want to bring your car back home with you. Yeah. So we send driver to, to okay. drive for you. Now this particular startup interests me, Zap Zap Math, because I know my kids, they need help in math. 
Zapzap Math makes learning fun and easy for kids. We do that by using games to make the experience joyous. So what we do is we take primary school content, um, syllabus and turn them into games. Each game is specially designed. So we break down the content into we break down the content into systems. So these are the various topics. Like you draw tree, multiplication, addition. And then these are the games. So we got a ton of games. Let's show you this one. This is pretty popular. So this is learn place values. 7 minus 5 is 2, but there's no 2. You actually need to break down a 10, which is what you need to do in school. But this way you get to actually touch it. Touch the 10 and know what you need to do. So this is an example of a game we have. We have 18 different games now. Every two weeks, we launch two new games. And while the kid plays, we have a teacher panel where you can see how the kid is doing. You can have multiple kids, and you can see how much they've done, how much of the content they've used. And you can go all the way down to what question they did, what was right, what was wrong, so you can really help them. Hi, I'm Dwight, CEO of DollarSmart. We're an online money transfer company looking to be the premier transfer company between ASEAN and uh, the rest of Asia. Uh, we're based here in Chiang Mai in Thailand and uh, we've got an office that's uh, operational, we're operational business and we're expanding as we speak. Operational in Australia soon and Thailand, uh, soon to be operational in Laos, Hong Kong, Cambodia and Vietnam. What makes you different? Can you tell us about that? Pricing? Yeah, sure, sure. So there's been a revolution in this space in the UK and the US and uh, we're looking to bring the same technology and the same pricing changes to this part of the world. So what makes us particularly different against the incumbents is pricing, we're far cheaper. You know, if you were to send 10,000 Hong Kong dollars through us, uh, it'd cost you about 2.8% in fees, or no fees and charge, but in FX spread. And if you use our competitors, it'd be anywhere to 7 to 11%. So generally meaning customers end up with more uh, Thai baht in their pockets, for example. So. As well as that, you know, we're a fintech startup. We've built our complete system end-to-end -end here in Thailand uh, with a great team up in Chiang Mai, and uh, we're looking to leverage that and roll that out globally and, and deliver a very customer-focused uh, experience that will be very local because I think uh, when people speak about money or want to communicate about money, they want to communicate it about in their local language. So um, Superhands was established about a year and a half ago. We, we're basically a virtual assistant company um, trying to disrupt the BPO space, or business process outsourcing space, which is quite traditional in nature, where you basically build a factory of manpower in India or Philippines um, to outsource monotonous work or manual work like um, contact center work, call center stuff, um, data entry. So what we try to do is we, we take um, processes, our company processes, shrink them down to smaller chunks and we crowdsource that to with the people. So we've got two sides on the model, the consumer side as well as the business side. On the consumer side, individuals can send in individual tasks like um, researching for information, sourcing for business leads, um, data entry work. And on the business side, we do larger scale work where you know thousands of hours of contact center work, hours of data entry work um, on a larger scale basis. Delivery is an app that helps you manage and book your deliveries of almost anything. We have three types of vehicles. First is city car, second is open bed pickup, and the third is box truck. So businesses can use us to move their merchandise from their warehouse to their retail stores or to their customers, and individuals can use our service to help them move condos or houses. Our service is only covered in Greater Bangkok. In Indonesia, our service covers Jakarta. So do you have, then have a tuk-tuk for delivery, no? No, no, we don't have tuk-tuks. <laughs> oh, okay, thank you very much. You know, Frank, this is my third Echelon event and your second. Uh, you know, I've been to this Singapore and we went both to uh, Malaysia and, and now here in Thailand. And it's amazing what we're seeing in this uh, in Southeast Asia, in this mobile first uh, region uh, with the growth of, of apps and the number of uh, um, uh, mobile penetration here. It's just, uh, it blows my mind. And especially today, I saw a lot of great startups uh, I'm from different parts. I saw some from Belgium, from Indonesia, from Malaysia. Uh, including here in Thailand, you know, so I'm impressed. Um, any any thoughts on uh, on the event today? 
Even like Echelon should be keep on coming. The even like this creating new opportunities for entrepreneurs. Uh, if you only have like uh, knowledge about encoding or anything at all, you can come here making some new contact and you can making new businesses. And all of these startup that happened today, new startup, and we keep seeing them every day. And this kind of make me fascinated that how this kind of event creating more contacts and more new business opportunity. And right now Thailand is big for startup. It's gonna be even bigger in the future. Yeah, and Echelon, I think it's a coolest event for startup. All right, so thanks again, E27, and we'll see you guys next time.